Hello and welcome to another episode of Platy Play, where I'm going back to Witchy World. The, the, that's about all I have to say right now. Except for I apparently cannot find my way through <laughs> the silo warp thingy. Eh. We. Oh look, notes. Yay! Let's press both buttons to go faster. Figures. <laughs> I have no idea why, but for some reason, I remember myself being a little better at this game. <laughs> Die! I need that. I wonder. I know it's electrified. Um. Maybe if I try to explode it. Yeah, that worked. I'm in Area 51. Woo! Another mumbo pad? That guy has to get around in this level. Where is he in this level anyway? Um. For some reason I remember it being some like a fiery volcano-ish type thing. It doesn't seem right. Oh. Oh. The ginger's actually behind that. I don't have the money van yet. Um. I don't have the grip boots. Let's find somewhere else to go, I guess. Well, I... I can do this. I don't know why I do this. Okay, now I do. Ah <laughs> Silly game, you can't outsmart me this time. Remember you're supposed to be able to get up that. Maybe I'm just really bad at it. I'll figure that out later. Oh, that didn't work. Hmm. Well. While I'm at the subject of exploding things. <laughs> What's in here? Pump Master 2. What happened to the first one? Oh. I'm actually holding onto the sign. So I need to split up. Is that what this says? To ring the bell requires three different strikes. Oh. Oh. So, I probably have to do like Bill Buster, regular ground pound, and um. What would the third strike be? The I K 
can't hit anything. Strike. Perfect. Banjo is slow. And of course, I can leave him on the switch. What do I press? There. <laughs> Minjo. I don't know why, but Kazooie just looks weird without the backpack. Yay! Giant bouncy castle! I guess I need to go on top of it. <laughs> that looks like it could be. I'm just. No. It does not look like it could be a ladder. Sort of. Okay, let's. What, what's on the top? <laughs> it responds to my movement. Am I supposed to see something? No? I guess I'll just go inside like a normal person. Um. The door's over here. <laughs> I know there's something to do with flying here. And there's probably this one. Yep. Balloon Burst. Welcome to the Balloon Burst Challenge. You have 60 seconds in which to score 50 points. Do you want to hear the rules? Yeah, sure. It's real simple. Shoot the balloons. Door with three points. Green get you two points. And red get one point. Let's see what you can do. Three, two, go! Oh, I don't like this. Yeah, this first person flying is not ideal. Yeah. Must get that blue one, and that red one, and that red one, nope. and that green one. No! Yes. Yes. Yeah. Nope. What was my score? Apparently just pathetically low. I really don't like the uh, lack of control. I do like that though. No. Give it infinite. Yeah, I saw another blue one. Yes. Yes. Oh, I still have to press A to go up, I guess. 
Well, that would be my bad. Yes! 50! Let's just shoot that last one for good measure. It's unfair! You win! How is that unfair? Ah, so that's on top. Do you want to play again? No. Huh. It's a bouncy castle. I would have expected to, you know, bounce. Let's go get Kazooie alone. I wonder how long it'll take me. Oh, look, I'm here. Whee! I don't even have to press anything to do the Talon Trot, because I am the Talon Trot. This is running through hoops, isn't it? Hoop hurry. Yep. We have 60 seconds to score 30 points. No. Wow, this is some real skill I'm showing. <laughs> okay, I lied. I have no skill. Haha, -ha. I don't see any blues. That's not a good sign. That means that the game is trolling me! Or, oh, there's one. Ta-da! It's not like it was worth it. It's not worth going back for. I already got the 30 points I needed. And is it supposed to be hard? It's a lot easier when you, you know, know what you're doing. Yay! No, you can't have. You scored enough points to win my hoop three points. I thought it, she was saying, like, you can't have it. Nope. I'm being a sore loser. So last episode I said I want at least three jiggies. That's two out of three. What should the third be? I don't know what the other jiggies here are. So I'll just find something. I'll probably go up the lift again. <laughs> Yay! Oh, and there's also, um... The option of trying to figure out what that third hit would be. I sort of miss from the first game, they would do a little dance, which ends in Kazooie eating the Jiggy. Oh well. I don't want to die every time. Okay, let's figure this out. Okay. One. Two. Maybe a grenade. Yeah! Grenades. Solution to every problem. Well, there's my quota. And only... 15 minutes into the episode! Yay! Now I can goof off and look like an idiot. More than usual.
Oops. Whoa. Well, there's Wumba. Um. No. No. Uh, that could have been bad. Oh, wait. I can just walk on. I know what to do. There. It changed midway. Okay. Where is he coming from? There he is. Okay. Can't grab that wire. Just gonna have to go the old fashioned way. Darn. Um, back up the ladder. Seems to me like I actually need to jump with some effort to get to it. There we go. It just looks like something's gonna come out of those holes. Maybe electricity. Maybe monsters. Probably electricity. Nice. Now I can have a little bit of an easier time. Yay! It's got a no food or drink sign. I, I already did everything I need with the food and drink I own. The fuel depot. Where am I? And those shovels are from um the mine. As is the music. Oh, that seems to be a dead end. Wait, there's one thing I didn't try. Wait. No! Wrong way! Wrong side of Kazooie! Ow! Oh. See, I guess I'll deal with that later. So, dead end. Leading to Glitter Glitch Mine. Hmm. It's not really gonna bother me too much trying to figure out where that goes. Dodger Dome. You know, it would have been like a smart idea if I decided to just take the lift all the way back, get to Wumba. Nope. Who needs intelligent ideas? This is Platy Plate we're talking about. Where I continuously fail at Banjo Tooie. For now. There will be other games I'll fail at later. I think it's just platforming. Platforming is just not my- Oh! Ha 
I'm cautious. I don't know if there's another one or something. Up I go! I haven't found either of the globos yet. It's probably like behind here. Nope. Oh wait, no. She's going. She might give it to me for free? I see it. Go find something that's just sitting right next to me. Oh, that feels like Animal Crossing with. Go deliver that to the guy next to me. <laughs> you have Globo. Want to give to Humba? I do. Sure. Magic ready. Jump and pull. I can be a truck! <laughs> oh, van. That's the funny thing about the van. It's got like a really high-pitched voice for a big old van. It's got an annoying puttering. But it has this nice touch where I can just run stuff over. I wonder if I'm needed over here. Well, it says pay here. Pay here to enter the furnace of Inferno. <laughs> the ride is now open. Maybe that's where Mumbo is. <sighs> what kind of place has something that dangerous as an entrance to their theme park? Yeah, this is exactly what I was thinking when I thought Mumbo. Open that up. Um, <laughs> if I remember correctly, there's a jiggy where I have to run all the way up there. Oh. I have to have Banjo at the bottom and then have Kazooie run up. That's going to be a pain. No! Lobo! I wonder what happens if I go in the fire. Oh. Okay. It's fine. I'll just, you know, drive through lava. That's believable. Cheeto pages. Okay, yeah, there's a separation thing there. Let's go back to the Area 51 thing. Now, I know I need the backpack to get the kid. I didn't even found the third kid. But the one kid that is severely overweight, I know I need a backpack. So I won't be able to do anything with him at the moment. Let's go get that Jinjo. I'm gonna run you over! Have you ever seen a car that just turns this nicely? Yeah. Oh yeah. I'm doing donuts in a mail truck. Yay! And the truck just doesn't bother him. Oh, 
so things run away from you. Sorry. Um. Go to the space zone. There's got to be something in there. Although I feel like I was just in here. Oh, look, a door. Oh, it's the trouble cleft. Is it? That's all that was there for me. Star spinner. Oh yeah. Mumbo magic. Haha. <laughs> What it feels like, Minjo. Don't mess with the bank truck. Um. Yeah. I'm gonna turn back into a barren bird. Now let's see if I can do that jiggy outside of Mambo's hut. Hut Wigwam. Wait, I was talking about Mumbo, so I was right. It's a hut. Skull Hut. Same thing. Manjo, why are you upside down? Oh, that puttering was giving me a headache. I'm so glad it's over. Outside Mumbo's skull. Mumbo has a lot to do. Okay. Um. So there's where Banjo needs to go. There's Speedy Shoes for Kazooie. Okay. Sort of a helicopter action. Why does Kazooie have lots of HP? <laughs> Ow! Ah. Kazooie, don't die! Darn it, Kazooie! I hope I start back at the- yep. Ah. I have to split them up again. Or get Banjo at least back to where he was. Ow. I don't understand why he can't roll. Oh great, Kazooie actually did. Yeah. Ow. That doesn't bode well. Let's just let you die again. Anyone order some roasted chicken? Banjo, your lack of mobility astounds me. Aside from the fact you're a bear. Well, since this one... You know, there was nothing... With a timer, I don't feel the need to go really fast. Aha! Where are they even coming from? Oh. From around the corner. 
Heh. <laughs> Such a much more effective jump when you're... Well. Okay, so what are the shoes for? Huh. I don't feel like there's any real need for the speed. <laughs> it's like a devil skull. With a honeycomb. Why is there an evil guy in Mumbo's skull? Doesn't add up. Hi, Mumbo. Yep, we got a Globo. Yes, I need your help. I need lots of it. Banjo, you don't even know the half of it here. Oops. Wait, so zapping them doesn't kill them? Where did he go? Eh. Better off not trying to kill him. The Inferno, where Mumbo is. And probably the only place in the whole level that doesn't need Mumbo. Eh, eh, eh. Mumbo, you scamp. Oh, this works. So this is the dodge -em zone. The dodge zone. Opened up the dodge-em zone! What else did I need? Oh, there's one inside. For the star spinner thing. Can't forget that. I can, of course, have they run away when he takes it out. I can open it. Hope this works. Power Star Spinner. I won't ever understand how you need magic to turn on electrical... Oh! It summons lightning. Okay. And of course there's a Jiggy at the top. And the pad actually disappears afterwards. Wasn't it? See? There it goes. Uh, which way is out? This way. It's so much nicer with light. I like light. Keep on moving. Come on, Mumbo, we got one more thing to open. What happens if you try to exit the world as Mumbo? Well, only one way to find out. Other than, you know, Google and stuff. What does this one do? Power. The saucer of power. Oh! That was a flying test thing? I don't remember quite well. It's funny. In a game where platforming is like the key to getting almost everything, 
flying just seems like it would be so important or so game breaking, but it's not. I have no idea where I'm supposed to. Is that a pole? It's at the top of that pole. Mumbo can look up. Um, I guess there's nothing that make me need to climb it. It's not like um, Donkey Kong 64 where there will be bananas like on the trees. Obviously, because it's wait. I wanted to try to exit the world. Mumbo not want to leave this world. Nasty men with loot skull. Fine. I'll go get Banjo. Well, it's shaping up to about 37 minutes. I'll end it about here. So next time on Platy Play, we're going to probably be able to finish up the level with all the things I opened. So see you next time. Bye.